Information is a funny sort of power. The way a government can use it to keep control of its citizens is insidious and sneaky, nasty in some cases. We have to all learn more about it. Um, we have to, in a way, rethink, rebase a lot of our philosophy. Part of changing that philosophy is to understand that our lives are not analyzed in the first instance by people, but by computer programs. Some people just don't have an understanding about what's possible. I've heard people say, well, no, we know nobody's reading our emails because they don't have enough people. Actually, hello, it's not, these emails are not being read by people, they're being read by machines. They're being read by machines which can do the sorts of things that search engines do. And can look at all the emails and look at all the co social connections and can watch. Sometimes these machines learn how to spot trends. You can build sort of systems which will just watch a huge amount of data and start to pick things out and then will suggest to the security agency, well, these people need to be investigated. But then the thing could be wrong. Boy, we have to have a protection. <laughs>